Hi, I'm Cameron. And I'm Lily. And we're here with the Clark Fork Watershed Education Program. Today we're going to talk about stormwater pollution. We did all this restoration here from the mining on the Clark Fork watershed. Is it going to be set for life, Lily? Actually, watersheds can become polluted in a lot of ways, and stormwater is the number one polluter of watersheds in Montana. I thought stormwater was just rainwater and snow melt. Let's go check it out. This is what's called a storm basin. It helps refill our aquifer with water. Every time it rains, it captures all of our surface runoff. Just like a well takes water up from an aquifer, storm drains help put water back into the aquifer. Pollutants like car oil and litter can run off from the streets and sidewalks into these storm drains. They end up back in our river as direct sources of pollution to the waterways. Not all storm drains look the same. And not all pollution looks the same. We can get pollution from agriculture and construction sites as well. So all of these storm drains collect water and put it into an underground piping system. Some of this water comes out through discharge pipes right into rivers like the Clark Fork. That's why it's super important to make sure that we keep these drain systems nice and clean so we don't have problems in our aquatic ecosystems. So it's not just mining that's polluting our waterways. It's really important to keep all of our drain systems clean and clear as well. Now you guys know why we continue to monitor the health of our watersheds even after we did all that restoration work. Thank you for joining us. And we'll see you next time.